I'm about to give you a nice versatile list of interchangeable frames made by Nike. Stick around. Hello and welcome, I'm Eyeglass Tyler. I wanna to talk to you about the best Nikes with interchangeable lenses. Well, why would you want interchangeable lenses, you ask? Well, if you don't already know, it's a nice feature, it's a nice functionality. If you wanna have multiple sets of lenses for different light conditions or perhaps for different sports, but not have to buy multiple frames. It's a nice convenience factor, it can be money saving. And so there are a lot of benefits to it also, they tend to look pretty cool and they definitely fit that more sporty aesthetic. And so there's that as well. What do all of these frames have in common? Well, they are all RXable. They can all be done in prescription. And that's very important to us here at SportRx because that's like our big thing. We do prescription. Doesn't mean you have to get them, but they're available. So if you wear a prescription, you can count on all of these frames working, possibly. Depends on your prescription. Reach out to our opticians. We'll help you out. All of these have grip. They're all really good for sport use, really and truly. And, and the sport options, the, the sports that they're good for in particular will range based on the frame. But for the most part, they're all pretty darn versatile. And I would probably recommend for just about every sport. The idea of this is to let you know what frame options you have, what these frames have to offer. I'll go over each one individually. If you feel like I missed anything and you still have questions, definitely leave them in the comment section below because we'd love to hear from you and we'll get back to you. Let's get into this list. We're gonna start with the Tailwind S. This is kind of a double feature because this is just a smaller version of the original Tailwind. So if you don't wear a small, you wear a larger size, the Tailwind might be the one for you. All of the same features, really and truly all the same design, functionality, everything between the two. And so it counts as two frames, really and truly. Uh, this has a more contoured lens design. Nike calls it their flying lens and it's pretty unique. Uh, in, in terms of really everything else on this table and anything else that has this interchangeable functionality, usually you see connection uh, from the frame to the lens on the entire top part of the frame. In this case, it's really just this corner. And what that allows for is a little more venting uh, along the majority of the top of the lens and kind of a cooler aesthetic, I think. It gives you a little more of that rimless aesthetic, a little more of that rimless design, that rimless look. And so this is a cool frame in that regard because that's pretty uncommon. Uh, it does have their floating nose pad, which I'm seeing more and more in all of their newer designs and newer styles, especially their sport styles. Uh, and this one I like because it's a little bit softer of a, of a rubber material, grip material. It's a little more flexible. And so I think comfortable all day long, you're gonna get more so with the softer nose pad. If it's more rigid, it can be a little bit uncomfortable over time. Uh, the lens hook in here, like I mentioned, is small. It's just in this upper corner and it is uh, vented all throughout. You have venting in the temples. You have venting in the nose bridge. That floating nose pad design helps to encourage airflow and circulation to minimize fogging. So that's a cool feature to check out. This has an SFW of 125, which lands you at a men's small or a women's small to medium. Hey, if you're liking this content, but maybe you have additional questions, perhaps about Nike, perhaps you have prescription needs. Well, like I keep saying, be sure to reach out to one of our very friendly, exceptionally experienced expert Sporter X opticians because we are eagerly awaiting your call. And for even more Nike frame reviews, unboxings, and prescription Nike content, check out our videos and blogs. We'll put a link in the description below. Next up, we have the Nike Skylon Ace XV Junior, another double feature here because this is the smaller, the junior version of the Skylon Ace XV. So if you're a larger fit, there is still an option for you. So this is uh, more of a youth size, or if you're grown and you just need a smaller frame, this could still be a great option for you. It is made out of nylon, so very lightweight, very thin, and they have a deep lens cut in this, which I like. It's especially deep right in the nasal area, so it gives you a lot of coverage and especially for sports where it matters to have a deeper lens, you have a little more lens there for you. I'm thinking golfers in particular, cause you keep your chin up. You want to be able to still look through the bottom of the lens and not under the lens. And so that deeper lens cut helps with that for sure. Uh, and it's a wrap design and you have a lot of coverage, a lot of protection in this, a little bit of extra protection on the peripheral. Thanks to this thicker temple design, at least right there at the front of the frame where it really matters. You do have grip in the temple. You have grip in the nose. This is a softer nose pad. It's still that saddle style, 
but not that newer uh, floating saddle style like I mentioned in the in the prior frame and will mention in others coming up here, but still nice and, and grippy. It's rubber, it's soft, it's gonna be comfortable all day long, and that venting is gonna help to minimize slippage because it'll allow to more directionally push uh, any moisture or uh, add more airflow. And when it comes to fit, this has an SFW of 127, which lands you at a men's small or a women's medium. And next up, we have the brand new Show X3. This is a new addition to Nike's line and one that we've been anticipating for a long time. It is the X2, which will come up later in this list, which is still a great frame and still available. Uh, they wanted to update it and they really did. They went a much more aggressive on the design in this and a lot more sport functionality. This is really and truly maxed out in terms of features for just about every sport application. You have an in injected frame material, so it is the most lightweight you can get, although I will be totally honest with you. It isn't the lightest feeling frame of all of these options and it's really because of how feature rich it is and you can see just the material. There's a lot of material in this frame. Uh, despite that, it is still impressively lightweight. This also has another contoured lens, kind of similar to the deep cut lens uh, in the prior frame and even deeper in this. So definitely good for any sport where it's important to have as much lens real estate as possible. Also very wrapped. You have a ton of coverage, a ton of protection with this lens and you have circulation everywhere. You have venting everywhere, especially in the top here. You have a lot of vent holes that's going to help to encourage circulation, encourage airflow, minimize fogging. One thing to note, if you are a prescription wearer, this isn't as widely accepting of prescriptions. If you have a really strong prescription, this probably won't work. Uh, definitely reach out to opticians, like I've said, and I'll probably keep saying that because we're here and we're happy to help you and we wanna hear from you. But the stronger prescriptions are, are potentially going to block those vent holes. So do keep that in mind if that's a selling feature for you and you have a moderately strong prescription. Other things like I will mention a lot more is this saddle style floating nose bridge. Of all of this nose bridge in the X3, I have found to be the widest. So it's going to be a little more accommodating for even a wider nose bridge. So that's pretty nice and it does have more of a medium flex in this and so I think it will still be nice and comfortable even all day long. You do have grip in the temple as well and a slightly adjustable temple, not immensely adjustable, just enough to get a little more of a customized fit for all day comfort. This is also in non-prescription available in their Nike Field Tint. They have a few other sport specific tints that you should definitely check out, but in prescription, like I mentioned, Definitely available in more sport optimized, especially Sport X, sport optimized lens tint options. When it comes to fit, the SFW on this frame is 135 millimeters, which lands you at a men's medium to large or a women's large. Next up, we have the trainer. This is probably the most lightweight frame on this table. Uh, it just in your hand, the first thing you notice is how crazy lightweight this frame is. And it is a nylon frame material, so like we know, very lightweight, also very durable and nice flex here, especially in the temple where it is designed to hold onto your head with enough pressure to hold, but not too much pressure to cause any pressure points or any discomfort. You have that in this frame, uh, no grip on the temple, but you do have a bit of a textured design on the material as well as some vents to help kind of directionally push any moisture, anything that would cause these to not grip as well, but it does have grip on the nose and this is another flexible floating saddle bridge, which uh, again, about medium uh, uh, flexibility and medium softness on the rubber here. So I think still a nice comfortable all day wear. And of course, like we know, that'll also give you venting and that'll also help to minimize fogging. With an SFW of 136 millimeters, this lands you at a men's medium to large or a women's large. Next up, we have the Maverick Free, and this one's interesting. So uh, like I mentioned in the first two frames, they're kind of a part of a family of frames. This is also a part of a family of frames, the Maverick family. This is specifically the Maverick Free, which is the 
the lens is free. The lens has been freed. It's a semi rimless design in the Maverick family. So they all in the Maverick family, they all have similarities. They all have an overall similar aesthetic and a lot of the same features, but this is the only one that is semi rimless. And so that's pretty cool. It gives you a little more vision in the vertical plane, right? Cause you don't have a frame getting in your way when you're trying to look through the bottom portion of the lens. So great for all those sports that would benefit from that functionality. This is more of a hybrid sport design. This is the only one on the table that is a flatter lens. This is a six base. So not that full eight base wrap that you are seeing in all of these other frames, which I think lends this to a more all day and just all around pair. So this is not going to be out of place in any just normal everyday activity and also would be great for just about every sport application you find yourself in. This is also a very lightweight frame and this is also made out of nylon and it has an especially flexible temple here, which I like. I think that that gives you a lot more long term comfort and there is grip on the inside of this temple. This does have that same saddle floating nose bridge. Probably the most rigid, no, absolutely the most rigid of all of them. So one piece of warning there, if you find that you have trouble with your bridge fit in different frames, then be careful with this frame because if it doesn't fit your nose well, it's never going to, and it might cause discomfort, it might, it might cause pain points. And so keep that in mind. The tapered temple is good for hat compatibility as well as grip. This is available in non-prescription with those sport optimized tints like the course tint, for example. And of course, in prescription, our sport optimized lenses that we offer at Sport RX. That six base flatter lens style is actually very uncommon in a semi rimless frame like this. And that is a cool thing because actually it makes it a little more compatible for a wider range of prescriptions. So even stronger prescriptions can potentially work in this frame. Again, opticians, reach out to us. We'd love to hear from you. With an SFW of 137, this lands you at a men's large or a women's large to extra large. And last but not least, we have the Show X2. This frame is very near and dear to my heart because it has been around for as long as I have been selling these frames. And it's just a really great go-to option for every sport application. I haven't found anything that this doesn't work well for. A really good style, not as aggressive as the X3, a little more everyday styling, but still very sporty, still very sport centric. Again, a lightweight frame, not the lightest weight on here, a little lighter than the X3. But again, you have a very durable, a very capable frame here. You have again, slightly adjustable temples, a little more so than the X3, but still not a ton. So you're really just getting a little more customizability in that fit for long term comfort. And this has a saddle style nose bridge that has vents designed into the nose pad, but it is adjustable. And that is probably my favorite thing about this frame is that you do have adjustable nose pads to get you that absolute customized nose bridge fit. With an SFW of 138, this lands you at a men's large or a women's extra large. That wraps up our list of top interchangeable Nike sunglasses. I hope now you have a much better idea of what these frames have to offer, maybe what to look for if you love Nike and you like the idea of them being interchangeable. And again, if you feel like I missed anything, leave it in the comment section below. We'd love to hear from you. By the way, if you decide to order from Sport RX, thanks to our See Better guarantee, you never have to worry about getting something that isn't right or doesn't work for you. You have as long as 45 days with them to figure that out and you just reach out to us. We take care of you no matter what that means on our end. Also, we have opticians. Did I mention that? We would love to help you get it right the first time. So reach out to us. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this was interesting or valuable information. If so, throw us a like because it would mean a lot to us. You can check out relevant videos here. Also, we have great content on our social media outlets and I would encourage you to check us out there as well. We are at SportRx.